I'm Veronica Mitchell and Abdullah Bayat and myself have been working on this paper for quite a while. We've called it Effective Assemblages Matter in Socially Just Pedagogies. This paper was sparked by our work in a larger project on socially just pedagogies, where we realized that we were staying with troubles in higher education and unpacking what we were doing in the classroom in different ways and how that mattered. Our paper is about affect and assemblages. Affect is constitutive and constituted in assemblages. So we're not looking at each student, educator, desk and chairs separately. Everything together. There's a dynamic interaction between everything. That's what we want to focus on and what we have in the paper. We've taken up a feminist new materialist perspective to really look at the relational aspects of our practices because we realized that there are transformative possibilities in this different way of thinking. So in my classes, I use participatory learning activities, but the focus is not so much on the activities itself, but it is about the atmosphere and the general affective climate that is generated by this interactive settings of teaching and learning. So the students are not positioned as empty vessels, rather they are positioned within a dynamic assemblage, a dynamic coming together of matter, of joy, information, and then we create something positively from that. Like Abdullah, I create open pedagogical spaces to enable effective flows through activities such as role-playing, poetry, music, art in the making. The students are busy with their obstetrics learning in their fourth year of their undergraduate medical studies, a difficult yet momentous part of their curriculum where they often face the inequality and injustice apparent in our health system. Let's make it alive. That's what we say. People, material, crayons, role plays. There are many things we can do in our classrooms to make it alive, to bring the passion, to bring creativity into the classroom. Let's do it. So what we're really saying through our paper is that pedagogic effect is important and it also enhances students' ability to engage with the entanglement of ethics in their learning. We hope you find this paper exciting, something to interact with, something to stimulate you in your teaching and learning. For us, it's been a really interesting journey. Um, writing about two very different professional fields out of business studies and medical education. And we hope this is an example of really breaking through interdisciplinary silos. Thank you.